everyone here as one will become one with this this ke liye agar aap chahte hain tinka batata hai inshallah aap kabhi bhi log karenge and if is a concept that if you use a wish we will tell you the technique if you wish to obtain this then you can obtain this from sarkar and your heart may also do allah na kar aur kaise koi masla nahi batayenge uska tarika ye hai aap jo allah ko andar lana aur tum ye bahar lata hai batao and the way to do this is that we need not to bring allah inside us by doing this it is he is our light usko rozana 66 martaba kagaz ke upar allah likhte hain अब किसी का ये जो होता है काम होता है कोई हाथ रखता है मिलता है किसी का नहीं मिलता है अपन के साथ उसका फिर क्या करें उसके लिए भले जरबे लगाए तो भले नाचे तो भले वर्जिश करे क्या <laughs> You will now see the present residence of Gohar Shahi in Kotri, Sindh. Time in August of 1996, Gohar Shahi confirmed that his facial image was on the moon. In addition to the moon, astronomers discovered a human face 150 times larger than the sun. Gohar Shahi confirmed that this face was a spiritual body from within his physical body. Nasirif Green, you are looking at a photograph of Mars. Not only on the sun and the moon, but it has recently been discovered that there is a facial image of Gohar Shahi on Mars. There is also his name Riyaz Ahmed Gohar visible and the name of God Allah on it. If you can match the photograph on the right of the screen with the image on the photograph of Mars on the left. You will now see two marble tiles which have the face of Gohar Shahi embedded in them. The first was discovered in a mosque in London and the other in a hotel in Rawalpindi, Pakistan. Recently some people from Manchester returned from performing umrah in Saudi Arabia and they brought back with them photographs of the Hijri Aswad the holy stone in the Kaaba Publishers in Mecca Mirza Library and Company have indicated that when the photograph is turned upside down a human face is clearly visible on it Many disciples including ourselves feel that the image on the holy stone is that of their spiritual guide when asked about this phenomena gohar shahi stated that this is a very sensitive matter this may be caused by science but it may also be a sign from god he also stated that muslim governments should fully investigate this matter and inform the public of the truth nazi are looking at a photograph of jesus Gohar Shahi has confirmed that this is a true image of Jesus. Whilst on tour in the United States in May of 1997, a meeting took place between Gohar Shahi and Jesus. This image of Jesus also appears on the full moon.
On 20th of June 1997, the Daily Jung in Lahore reported that astronomers in the United States had discovered a 200 mile long image of Jesus on the face of the moon. This was composed of light and reflection. Photographs taken by NASA astronomers in 1992 have been concealed from the public. Further, according to this report, priests in America have demanded that the photographs and this information be released to the public so that it would strengthen the faith of the people. The teaching of the, of the Torah and the Injil, again, I wish I could refer more to the teaching of the Quran, but in case I get it wrong, I won't. So I'll stay with the Torah and the Injil. It mentions that there are three aspects that form man. One is the, the physical body that we live in at the moment. The other is the, the soul, which is our being within that body. And the third one is the spirit of God, which unites the soul and the body to make one whole. Now, is that the same teaching? Kare Fikar, Torah or Injil, there is a teaching that there are three aspects of the human being. There are three aspects of the human being. One is the एक रूह जो ऊपर से इसमें आई तीसरा अल्लाह की रूह जो इन दोनों को मिला के रखती है कह रहा है क्या ये यही तालीम है आपकी यही तालीम बाय बयान करी है या द सेम थिंग सेम इन डिस्क्राइब्ड पूछा है जब इंसान की मौत आती है तो इन तीनों हिस्सों को क्या होता है एक हिस्सा ऊपर चला जाता बाकी तीन एक एक हिस्सा कब्र में चला जाता एक रूह ऊपर चला जाता है बाकी जो चीजें हैं उसके साथ वो एक कब्र में रह जाता है कुछ अरसे बाद खत्म हो जाता है वन वन एस्पेक्ट योर बॉडी मटेरियल बॉडी स्टे इन योर ग्रेव एंड इट डिस्ट्रॉय हेयर द अदर सोल दे गो वन वन ऊपर वन वन एस्पेक्ट इस ऑन द फर्स्ट स्ट्रैंड तो बाकी सोल जो है ना वो कब्र में है एंड द � in the grave, then they help people and uh, give them blessing. If they are a devil, 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 they are a devil. And if it, your soul has a, a negative power, negative power, then it harms people and that called bad eagles and bad souls. Then they are a devil, they are a devil, they are a devil, they are a devil. They trouble the people and they... These are three aspects. The three aspects. You know, uh, again, the Torah states in, I think, four or five different places, the angel in about two different places, that the dead know nothing. The dead know nothing. That the, the, the spirit of God returns to God, but the soul ceases. Soul ceases? Ceases at that point. That this, the only time that the soul has knowledge again is when God raises that soul to have a new body, as you mentioned, a body that is completely different from the bodies we, we have at the moment. How does, does that correspond with, with these teachings? There is a reason that when the soul comes to the soul, the soul of Allah, the spirit of God, goes up and goes up. And the other soul is going to be seized and finished. So we have said that if the soul is going to be finished, it will be finished. He said the same thing. If you do not have a power in your soul, whether negative or positive power, then it finishes at that point. If you have a positive power, it is still there alive, helping the people. If you have a negative power, it is still alive and disturbing the people. 